Yep. I think they said we got down to 23 last night. Oh, yeah. She's looking sad. I mean, I figured that was going to happen, but not November 13th, for God's sakes. Everyone else seems to be doing all right. We got some discoloration here in the filifera. Um, I think my little Washingtonia doesn't look very happy. But um, Canary Island looks good. I have a spotlight on it, so she looks all right. The outer, actually no discoloration in that Canary Island. Pindo has been there for a while. He can take it. Windmill's cool. No, my Washingtonia's little discoloration in there uh, I lost all most of the fronds at about 17 19 17 degrees last year so I'm not gonna worry about them until we get down to that type of uh, temperature over here got some uh, discoloration in that Washingtonia um, Sable's doing all right he can handle it he's been there two and a half years He's seen some cold nights. Other windmill doing really good. Windmills take it the best. Windmill sables take the cold the best. My agave is pretty strong there. It's not just a little discoloration. Mediterranean. He's been there a while. These are supposed to be real cold hardy. Not too much discoloration in that bad boy. Parlor palm. I just threw it in the ground. And uh because I didn't have nowhere to put it. I don't think this one's going to survive. This guy's still burnt from last year. Um, might lose that whole thing, but if the roots stay safe, it could come back. You never know. Livestona, Livestona chinensis was all right. I covered her up. But it looks like the deer is just munching. I didn't know deer likes palms. Little Sona recipients, a little bit of deer bites there. Other than that, they're all right. I just cover them with big old pots. And the big washies look a little dark. Some discoloration in there. None too happy. But uh, I got the light on them. So as long as we keep the base nice and warm. And she was pushing out a new spear there. Sad. But yeah, I mean, that's what happens at 24, 25 degrees, you know. But we didn't lose everybody, so that's a good thing. Some more discoloration there. And another sad banana. Oh, winter.